Scientists working at Rick have discovered a new and exciting state of matter that they're calling a perfect liquid. Tim Hallman of the Physics Department explains. Yes, this is a truly exciting moment for the, the scientists working on the relativistic heavy ion collider. And uh, we had a press release actually at the American Physical Society meeting in Tampa, Florida about a week ago to announce that we've discovered uh, a new state of matter. And it has properties that are quite unique. Uh, it behaves like a perfect fluid. So uh, you can imagine our excitement. Uh, it's a little bit like when you were a child, perhaps, and you had some silly putty, and you were really astounded by the, its properties. It, it bounced higher than you expected, or perhaps it lifted up a picture uh, off the newspaper. Uh, in the case of Rick, we expected that when we collided gold nuclei together at the speed of light, we would create a system of weakly interacting quarks and gluons. And in fact, uh, the matter we produce behaves much more like a perfect fluid, uh, perfect liquid. Uh, what we mean by that is that the elements of the fluid or the matter uh, move collectively in response to pressure gradients in a way that's quite unique. Uh, you can think perhaps an analogy uh, of a school of fish. And you've perhaps seen this on the Discovery Channel that you'll have thousands of fish all swimming together. And they seem to be able somehow to all turn on a dime and without bunching up. And that's analogous in some respects to the way this matter behaves. The place where we are now, we've discovered that we've produced something truly uh, new and unique at Rick. And of course, the next thing you want to do is to get off the boat and go ashore and explore and, and really understand the landscape. And that's uh, what we plan to do in the future at Rick. To do that e efficiently and effectively, we need some upgrades of the, the detectors and of the machine. And that's the next phase of exploration, which we would call Rick 2. We need to upgrade the the luminosity of the Rick machine by a factor of 10 and to add some new detector capability to Star and Phoenix. So it's a very exciting time. Uh, we've successfully crossed the ocean, if you will, and discovered the new world scientifically in, in heavy ion collisions. Uh, we're the only facility in the world at the moment with this capability. And uh, the perspective is that we now want to go forward and, and study this unique new matter in even greater detail and uh, with the continued strong support of the Department of Energy and the American public, uh, it's a really bright future.